Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. And in today's video, I'm going to be giving my review for a film that I've seen when I was younger. But I couldn't remember nothing about it. I remembered liking it. And after we watched it, I know why I liked it. Um, did it hold up? Not really. And that is Virgin Territory. Starring Hayden Christensen, Misha Barton, and Tim Roth. Uh, this is a period piece comedy uh, where, set where uh, this guy played by Hayden Christensen, he's just... What's that name sound familiar? Star Wars? Oh! How could I not remember <laughs> that? My God, I'm slipping. Um, see? So beautiful. A lot beautiful with the Anakin hair, though. Um, he's basically just a horny guy looking for sex throughout the whole movie. He ends up, uh, joining this, uh, convent of nuns that are horny nuns and it's just having sex left and right with them there's a lot of a lot of boobs in this so if, you know a lot of and obviously nuns aren't supposed to be doing that. obviously when i it triggered my memory why i liked this movie back when i was a lot younger I probably shouldn't have been watching it but <laughs> uh, and then misha barton's character she is supposed to be marrying this uh prince uh, basically like an arranged marriage type deal. Uh, but she's actually fallen in love with Hayden's character while also being, uh, in a way forced to marry Tim Roth's character. So you got this love triangle. But then, it's just, there's a lot, a lot does go on in this movie. Um, but for the most part, this is a movie you watched basically just to see a lot of boobs. I mean, if we're just being honest. Um, it's not great. It's, it's watchable. I mean, it, I, I made it through it. I didn't laugh a ton. Um, so it, I don't think it works on a comedy level for me. But, it's definitely nothing I can recommend. I mean, it's one that, um, it's just, they don't show the sex stuff in it. But it's just a lot of upper nudity and stuff like that. Um, it's one that you obviously, if you watch, you don't want to take seriously. Uh, you just go in, shut your brain off, try to have a good time with it. But it just did not hold up for me personally. I gave it a two and a half out of five. Will I keep this? Probably and just pack it away because it's from my childhood. Um, it's something I watched growing up. So there's nostalgia there for it. Um, but how often will I come back to it? Probably not a lot, which is why I'm packing it away in my tub. Um, but... Uh, At least it's not staying on the shelf. Yeah. <laughs> it's not staying on the shelf, but I'm not getting rid of it for nostalgia purposes. But uh, that happens sometimes with movies. We all have those movies that, we, that aren't great, but we keep because they're... They are important to us. So, my wife don't understand that because she's not that way. But <laughs> No, I only keep the ones I actually think are, are good movies. Even if they're like kid movies and I like them. Like... Yeah. But, so yeah. Definitely can't recommend it. But, that is everything for this review of Virgin Territory. So, please, comment, like, subscribe. Hit the bell to be notified for our videos. And we will see you all in the next one.